Before we were farmers, blacksmiths, tailors, scientists, philosophers, AI experts or management gurus, we were artists. Because it is our ability to conjure up pictures to imagine the new that took us from cave dwellings to space stations. At Global Art, this is at the root of our approach to art. We believe art is not a hobby, but an essential skill in a changing world. Creativity is the foundation for innovative thinking, and we believe Global Art develops this foundation in children, helping them to become innovative thinkers of tomorrow. The program trains children to develop their imagination, their ability to present a unique idea in a very creative way. Children develop their ability to think independently. This program develops the child's self-confidence. So you see, it's not just a drawing program. The Global Art program started off in Malaysia in the year 1999 and since then has spread out to 17 countries across the world. Today we have a presence in Singapore, in China, Indonesia, Thailand and so on. In India we launched the Global Art program in 2005 in Chennai and today we are very happy to say that we have reached out to 55,000 children across 128 locations in seven different states in the country. Largely what happens is, children learn to explore their ideas, express those and then finally translate them onto paper through vivid pictures. Now this is possible largely because we've got a very strong training mechanism. Our teachers are trained and at the end of the training program there is an assessment based on which they are certified to take classes. Students have gone on to choose really different careers as after they've finished the Global Art program. Uh, they've chosen largely professions where there is a lot of creative thinking required. They've gone on to become architects, interior designers, fashion designers, and they attribute their choice of career largely to the Global Art training that they've undergone. There are many others who've taken the traditional route, have gone into engineering or medicine, but there again, they have a very valid point of how the creative thinking instilled by Global Art has really helped them in whatever projects that they've handled. I am an architect and naturally drawing skills are a huge help in my profession. Art helped me develop observation skills, the ability to focus on tiny details and handle them effectively in my projects. Global Art also showed me how to bring ideas to life, both for myself and my clients. Global Art has helped my daughter be innovative and find solutions to many problems. It not only helps in art, but it also makes you look presentable if you are able to choose the right color and wear it on yourself. Global Art helps my daughter to unwind when she is really stressed out. For me, my classes at Global Art were always the best part of the day. There was time to explore, have fun and relax. I found not only my aptitude for design and art here, I discovered my passion for it too. It also helped me find a place at NIFT and that's just the bonus. My son is also a part of Global Art. He has been participating in a lot of international and national art competitions. His ideas are so innovative and he has developed a lot of uh, competitive spirit. I think art lets you look at everything from a different perspective and gives you insights into the way things work. This approach to thinking has helped me a lot in my engineering classes. It was at Global Art that I picked up the habit of going beyond the obvious to see new and exciting possibilities. Global Art, more than the art, what I feel is that they inculcate different ideas and have various grades and children really look forward to the classes. So it's not a very monotonous kind of coaching for the children. 
skill is important. Creativity is equally important and global art gave me both. It helped my understanding of lighting, which is essential for filmmaking. What is even more vital was that it helped me with conceptual thinking. The ability to think up bright ideas is the starting point for a creative career, any career in fact. This is an excellent, I think, uh, attitude building exercise. And I see that many of these kids going to be thought leaders for building this nation. And it is not hobby, but it is a formation of attitude. For a person, wherever he or she goes in life, whether one wants to become scientist, engineer, or uh, astronaut, or anything, that this whole focus, the activity when you are involved in some creative activity, you are building up a kind of temperament which certainly helps in anything which you do in future. I wouldn't call Global Art a drawing class. It was more of a space to open up and go beyond conventions. Global Art was one of the first space, I would call it, to you know stand out and try out something very different where uh, we were asked to think beyond the possibilities. Get away from what is possible. Being a student of design and an aspiring designer, I think it is very much required to unlearn and uh, let go of things, you know, it gave a space for crazy ideation and it has really helped me and parents should realize the necessity of uh, creative thinking. Even if they want their kids to go into mainstream professions, it's okay. But why not implement creative thinking in it? Because it, that really helps. Develops your cognitive skills and holistic thinking. Parents should see that potential. Global art helps the child imagine a better future and make it happen too.